Let's take it slow Where you go, I go to And if you hit the bottom, I'm going down with you Let's take it slow Hi guys, Assalamu Alaikum and welcome back to my channel I hope you're all doing well So in today's vlog, I've got Sakiba's birthday So here, uh, I went to Next to buy her few stuff for her birthday um, her birthday was actually in January, so I've got a bit of a backlog with my vlogs. But slowly, one by one, I'm trying to upload them. Um, I'm just really busy with lots of assignments and um, other things. But inshallah, in a few months' time, I'll be finishing all that. And then I'll have a bit more time on my hand to spend on my vlogging. So anyway, uh, I went to next the day before her birthday to pick up her presents and some clothes as well my brother-in-law moved to portugal and he left some money for her to buy her a present so he told me to go to the shops and buy some clothes for her before her birthday so that's what we're Hello, doing tk max now what are these Look at this, guys. This is only four ninety nine. And look at this, this huge dish. It's perfect for tal. It's only seven ninety nine. Really good. For money. And look at this. This is only 9 .99. And then I came across these beautiful um stuff I don't know what to call them but they're like trays and um, basket kind of things and I think um, these are made of bet that we have in Bangladesh I'm sure these are handmade and they were so pretty and the price wasn't too bad either so I had to look around I didn't buy any on that day but I might go back and get some because they look so beautiful and I'm sure these were handmade. I remember my mum used to make these. She's so good at it. And um, and I'm not. I'm sure it's not just my mum. I'm sure majority of our mothers uh, watching this video used to make these handmade things like facha and um, adi and things like that. It's a shame we're losing that tradition now. And then this is on the day of her birthday, um, I went to Nirala. We're always used to getting cake from cake box because I'm going to be honest, it tastes the best out of all the cake shops that we've bought so far. But I thought um, we'd try something different this time because we've had quite a few birthdays and we've had cake box cakes for all of the birthdays. So I went to Nirala. Um, because I was going on Winslow Road anyway for some other reason so I thought I'd pop in and get a cake from there and since I haven't invited anyone it was just going to be me, Sakiba, Yamin and my husband so I didn't want to make a big deal out of it so I just picked up a cake whatever was already made there so um, you'll see which cake I picked up on her birthday um, I was just having a look around um, and on that day it was pouring down as well so I called the Uber so whilst I was waiting for Uber I thought I'd show you guys around in the shop so I love these biscuits that they have um, it reminds me of Bonneville in Bangladesh that's how they sell biscuits in Bangladesh as well and here they have the chat and a few other snack items and here they have um, all the sweet desserts. Yeah. This Nirala is on Winslow Road, by the way. I'm not sure if I mentioned it before. Okay. 
Have we got any square ones or not? Just all round ones. Um, I'll have this one then, please. Vanilla, yeah. So, if you want to try their cake, um, you can do. I would recommend it. Sometimes it's just nice to try something different. And the customer service is really good as well. So, um, it was a nice experience. This is the day of Sakiba's birthday. And in the morning, I took her dress out that she's going to be wearing and a crown that she chose because Yamin was saying he really wants her to get a crown and wear it on her birthday. And here I was asking Sakiba to do a bit of cut walking to show us the dress. Usually she's a really shy type of person and she would never do it. But this time I was surprised that she actually did it for me and she looked really beautiful in it, mashallah. And I just want to say, please keep her in your du'as. May Allah make her a good Muslima, grant her healthy, long life. I um, actually pray for both of my children, please, for Allah to keep them healthy and make them really good Muslims. So anyway, this is the time Saki was opening her presents. So the night before, I wrapped all her presents and Yamin wanted to join in to open the presents as well. So I wrapped a couple of presents for him as well because I knew he's going to cry when he sees Sakiba's presents on the day. And here, my niece and nephew, Sadiqa and Jamil, came to drop off the presents. Um, Yamin wasn't feeling too well, so I hadn't really invited anyone to come down because I was worried that he's going to catch something else whilst he was already ill. Um, and he was just recovering there. So anyway, this is a beautiful present that Reba made for Sakiba, and she was really pleased with it. You'll hear her reaction in the next clip. So Sakiba's slowly going through the hundreds of presents that she's got. She got some money from her nanu as well, um, and so did Yamin. Every time my mom gives um, money to one of them, she gives it to both of them which I always question her about, but she says she can't give one and not the other. So anyway, here, Saki was cutting the cake now. This birthday was really weird, actually, because for the first time we were celebrating it on our own. So I thought Saki was not going to want to do it on her own. I thought she's going to throw a tantrum, but mashallah, she was quite mature about it. And she said, OK, fine. Um, so I told her, I said, everybody will calm down when Yamin is better. And she said, OK, that's fine. But if that was old her, she wouldn't have had it any other way. She loves her Api, Sadika, and she doesn't want to do anything without her. But this just shows my daughter's growing up. She's nine now. So this was um, an evening birthday, guys. Usually we cut the cake after eating but this time I decided to cut the cake first because when you have children they can't wait to cut the cake um, and I made some of Sakiba's favorite dishes as well so I made tili I made tandoori chicken um, she loves tili so I was making that I'm not sure how many of you have tried it but um, Sakiba loves that and here she opened all the presents and in the night time she was looking at all of the presents and she told me to record everything so that she remembers what she got for her present when she watches my videos. So even Yamin got his present that his uh, Sasa gave him and he was putting it next to all Sakiba's presents. And this is the present yeah, um, my nephew Ridwan got her. So sweet of him, he even chose it himself. So Sakiba was having looking at it and she loved the present. So Ridwan, thank you from Sakiba for a beautiful present. She loved it.
the art set, this one, and the um, painting set was from her younger Sasa, Samad. So thank you, Samad, for this beautiful gift from Sakiba. She really loved it. Um, and I think she actually told my brother-in-law what to get. And the clothes that I got for her from my other brother-in-law, um, I forgot to record. And this was a um, makeup set from Yamin to Sakiba. And this is her first ever halal perfume from her Suto Mama. And so her birthday was coming to an end. This is in the night time. I was cooking her favorite curries. I already made the tandoori chicken and gila because they take time. And here I'm cooking chick um, king prawns, which are her favorite as well. So I kept it nice and simple since it was just us who's going to be eating. So I just made Sakiba's favorite dishes. So I made king prawn, I made chicken liver and I made lamb. Um, and I haven't shared any of the recipes in this video today because the video was getting too long. I did record it, but I cut it off. And also, I think some of these recipes are already on my channel anyway. So if you want to have a look, feel free to do so. So here are the final looks of my curries. That's the lamb curry. This is the chicken liver. And finally, this is the king prawn. So I hope you enjoyed this vlog, guys. If you have, please don't forget to like, subscribe and share it with your friends and family. And please keep me and my family in your duas. Until my next video, take care. Assalamu alaikum. Mm -hmm.